The Powerball is worth more than a billion dollars. The odds of winning are one out of 292 million. But this is such a huge number, it's hard to wrap our minds around it. So let's look at this a different way. I'm going to bring in two football fields. That's 200 yards of grass. Now I'm going to add one blade of grass and paint it red. Here it is. I'm going to plant it around the 40 yard line of field number one. Now here's where you come in. I'm going to blindfold you and ask you to walk out into the field of your choice and pick one blade of grass. If you pick the red one, that's what 292 million to one looks like. But it's baseball season. We love our Astros. So let's bring in Minute Maid Park and 41,000 plus fans to the game. You're at the game. Look around. This is what one in 41,000 of one odds looks like. For Powerball, you need 7,122 more Minute Maid Parks in order to get to 292 million. In fact, Dr. Uh, Bur Burrell Merentz of East Carolina University said if people understood probability, they would never buy lottery tickets. But somebody wins Powerball and Mega Millions and that's why a lot of us play. Are there worse odds? Yes. Look at this, over a three year period, 20 year old Dylan McMillan was bit by a shark, a bear, and a snake. The odds of that happening or one in 896 quadrillion. This is the person who needs to be playing the Powerball. By the way, if you've ever wondered about winning both, the odds of winning both the Powerball and Mega Millions is one in 75.6 quadrillion. You have better chances of getting struck by lightning twice, one in 19 million, dying from severe weather, one in 58,669, or becoming president of the United States. Those odds are one in 32.6 million. Several people have checked the math on this. It's accurate.